first conduct in three fourths time. Do not touch the analog stick. Just try to match the rhythm by tilting uh, those buttons. Uh, just, just fucking do it. Okay. Okay, I'll, I'll try this. Doesn't look too hard. Uh, 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 okay. Very nice. That was splendid. Next is four fourths time. Um, okay, let's do that thing. This is actually like the easiest thing to do, although most people suck at it when they first try it, including myself. It's just, most people don't realize that you don't actually have to hit the, fuck, I failed. I was, most people don't realize you have to, you don't have to hold. Never mind, just ignore me. <laughs> I can't concentrate on both at once. Okay, there we go. That's it, Luigi. That was not bad for your first time using the Wind Waker. Not bad at all. You can also conduct with it in six-fourths time by tilting the uh, analog stick to the right. You would do well to remember that. You've got the Wind Waker. So now I can actually go back and go any direction on the sea I want. That would have been very handy to use last episode when I fucking failed and had to go back really slowly. Whatever. Past the past. Can only worry about the future. Don't tilt that. Okay, okay, I don't need your instructions. I know how to play with the Wind Waker. So welcome to Dragon Roost Cavern. This is a place where I would live if I could. It is absolutely beautiful here. Oh look, I'm holding a bomb. Maybe I should probably drop this. Kaboom! There goes the boulder. The boulder had a wife and family, but I made him explode. Anyway, I absolutely love this island. Just because it, the music, the characters, the... I'm actually writing a book where I'm... Where the residents of this island are inspired. In, I mean, they inspire a species in the book I'm writing. Not completely, but part of it. Like, they have wings. That's basically it. But I got the idea from this. So... <laughs> Blowing up rocks. People who <laughs> live on this island totally don't mind Link just blowing the shit up. <laughs> right? I mean, how did the rocks even get there in the first place? I will never know. Let us just sidle along this wall. Oh, look, a rupee. What is that just doing sitting on the edge? Someone must have dropped it. I'm not gonna complain, though. Uh. So... Is there a way to, like, put these down gently so that I don't... Yeah, that there is. Good. I don't want to throw it and then have it bounce back and hit me. Alright, let's just head up here. I'm really sorry that it's been such slow progress. I've been trying to go fast. It's just, I keep making mistakes and, like, doing things slowly. But I'm going to try to speed things up a little bit. Luigi? Luigi, is that you? It is. I'm pleased to see you're okay. I must say, you've traveled far for one with no wings. I mean, I have a boat, so it doesn't really matter. And your sister, is she? She's dead. I'm just kidding. Is that so? Good, I hated that dumb bitch. Um, well, don't worry too much. I'm sure she'll hang in there. I have an idea, Luigi. Would you like to meet our chieftain? I've been- I've told my people here about you, and all of us Rito are very concerned. These are the guys who created League of Legends? I'm certain the Chieftain will befriend you and lend you the aid of our Airy, whatever the fuck that means. It's settled then. I'll fly on ahead and let everyone know you're coming. Come inside, Luigi. I'll be waiting. Sounds good, bruh. Just, uh, lead the way. And I'll join as soon as I can. Alright, let's do this. Up the ladder. Up the stairs. I don't know why I call it a ladder. It's not really a ladder. So. I just realized this is going to take a really long time considering how long this game is. But, you know, I don't care. I think this is a fun game. And even if it takes me several months to complete this LP, it's a project that... 
I am passionate about, and I don't care if it takes a ton of time. Well, have you discovered the cause of the great Baloo's anger? <laughs> if it was this was the Jungle Book, his name would be Baloo. Aw, oh, so you are Luigi, are you? Quill has told me all about you. A troubling tale, indeed. I insist that you let us know if there's anything we can do to help you. We shall do everything in our power to assist you. Thanks, sir. I mean, I don't exactly know what I did to earn that, but whatever. However, in the meantime, we have a problem of our own to deal with. I knew there was a but. When you arrived on the island, did you notice the raging dragon perched atop the mountain? Uh, yeah. Uh, my boat pointed it out to me. I know that probably doesn't make sense to you, but my boat talks. As you can see, you are a fucking insane, psychotic, crazy, drug-addicted, cocaine man. That's what Link is. I just, I just labeled Link. So, we of the Rito tribe are pr profoundly connected to the sky. We make our livings on the airways. We do so by the graces of the Sky Spirit, Valu. When our Rito reaches adulthood, he or she journeys to the top of Dragon Roost to receive a scale from the Great Dragon. And it is this scale that enables the Rito to grow his or her wings. Recently, however, the once gentle Valu has grown violent and unpredictable. Sadly, we can no longer approach him. If this continues, the fledglings who are of age will never be able to receive scales from Valu on Dragon Roost. That will remain wingless, and in time, our very way of life will be threatened. I cry every time. As chieftain of the Rito, my first responsibility is to solve this problem. My apologies, but I must ask you to wait for our assistance until this is done. Will you do so? Yeah, of course. I'll do anything for you. Get in my bed then. Chieftain, what do you think of the consulting Luigi with regards to your son, Prince Kamali? As you can see, Luigi is a gallant young lad. I feel certain that Prince Kamali would open his heart to him and speak freely of his fears and worries. Everyone just seems to love Link, like he did something so great. I mean, this quest just began, it's not like he's done any heroic deeds quite yet. He just- <laughs> the chieftain's just giving him that look. That may be. Let me direct- me direct. My son Kamali is of the age to earn his wings. Yet, he is weak in some ways, and in light of the current situation, he may just give up on ever getting them. What say you? Will you share some of your courage with my son? Will you meet with my son? Yeah. I thank you. We shall do our best to solve our problem as quickly as possible, so that we may better help you with yours. I have something I wish for you to give to my son. A young girl named Medley is holding it for me. Would you find her and take it? I am counting on you. So, we must find Medley and find out what she wants to give us to Prince Kamali. Here, Luigi, take this with you. Who knows, it might come in handy. Hands in like a machine gun. This could definitely come in handy. Oh look, I got a delivery bag. I don't honestly remember when once we need to use that. With so many pockets, it can hold many items. Select it on the item screen and press Y, Z, or X to see what you have inside. Sounds like a good, jolly plan. You should find Medley in one of the upper rooms. Leave the Great Blue to us. Yes, sir. In the meantime, do your best to aid Prince Kamali. I fucking love the way they fly. It's amazing. So let's go find Medley and see what she wants because we need to talk to Prince Kamali before we can do the dungeon. There's just so much story in this game. It's like, I love Zelda for that. So wait, where's Medley? Oh, there she is. Hey, Medley. I drew a photo of Medley once. I'll post a link to that in the description. It's a pretty terribly drawn photo, but I'm proud of it. Wow, you really do have green co uh, clothes and a shit. Fuck me. Wow, you really do have green clothes and a strange shaped hat. You can just tell that she wants him. You're Luigi, aren't you? Oh, me. I'm an attendant to the great Sky Spirit, Valu. My name is Medley. Well, to tell the truth, I'm not an attendant quite yet. 
but I'm actually studying to be one. Oh, what am I thinking? Here, this is from the chieftain. Luigi, he wants you to give this to Prince directly. Fuck. Fuck Prince directly. You can tell when I've been recording for a really long time. <laughs> what did I get? You got accepted father's letter. And Medley's just looking at him like, why the fuck are you like putting that up in the air like that? Since you've just received a fine delivery bag, why not use it to carry this letter down to Prince Kamali? When you want to take it out, choose your delivery bag on the item screen and set this letter to Y, Z, or X. The room way in the back on the first floor is Prince Kamali's room. You have to go down a couple steps to get there. When you meet Prince Kamali, please don't get offended by his manner. He has no bad intentions, I promise. By the way, um, listen, Luigi. I have a small favor I'd like to ask of you. Which, could you please come to... Would you please fuck me? I know I, I know I'm just a bird. And I know I probably, I'm like all weird cell shaded and shit, but you know, you're cell shaded too. And you know, I don't know. What am I talking about? <laughs> Can you just please come with me to the entrance of Dragon Room's Cavern later and fuck me there, please? I'll explain everything then. I mean, there won't be a whole lot to explain because I'll be naked and then you'll be naked too and you know how things go, but you'll see how things go. Okay, um, well, in the next episode of Wind Waker, we're gonna get the next heart container and talk to Prince Kamali and do something else that Medley requested, but I might not put that in the video. Anyway, see you all later, losers.